Hi everyone, Wally Nichols with the Asset Guidance Group weekly update from the week ending May the 27th, 2022. Happy Memorial Day weekend. We hope you have a great uh, long holiday. Of course, the markets are closed Monday and we will be too. Meanwhile, here's what happened uh, for this week as we close out here in the last half of the trading day uh, here on Friday. Um, you have uh, the markets doing a bull rally and a well-established downtrend uh, for, for all of the indexes, although the small and the mid caps are trying to turn momentum positive. The S&P 500 is flirting with positive momentum. The NASDAQ is doing better than everybody else today, but as of right now, the indicators are not quite uh, uh, at that point. What uh, it looks likely is that this could continue uh, until Tuesday, Wednesday next week. Uh, if if, if the, uh, nothing bad happens over the weekend and then uh, we continue to go, uh, upwards, uh, these guys will probably be meeting their resistance at their respective 200-day moving averages and then turn it back around. There's a couple of them that are uh, flirting with the, uh, the 50, their 50 days uh, uh, near term is, uh, will be the, the average, but uh, that's that's where resistance will probably kick back in and then, uh, you know, watch out uh, after that. So there's a little bit of room here to make some money. Uh, it's kind of got to go and uh, an in and out play. But uh, having said that, uh, everything is still firmly uh, established in a downtrend, uh, except for very, very short term uh, uh, plays moved on a short term indicator, which are, are, are not altogether reliable for long term investing. All right. So we'll do that. Here's what's happened this week in commodities. OK, so commodities are still uh, they're changing. And so the big play here is metals have all turned down and uh and, and what's what uh the we're seeing people uh there there's a um a short they're shorting the metals especially gold okay that's your uptrend in commodities right now it's because uh because the gold shares are are on the on the down run as well as silver so your your short metals are are uh, running right now as well as real estate real estate has now turned down and it started dropping uh changes right now that doesn't mean that uh the Atlanta market per se is, but in general, uh, across the, the national uh, averages and the index funds uh, are uh, have, have flipped just like commodities have, and um, are uh, the the play there is on the short side. So uh, you know, govern yourself accordingly uh, as we go along here. The top uh, commodities that are still working is the energy plays. Okay, uh, and then um, so your total energy plays, total returns on those, those, those have, have done up well. Uh, energy, utilities, and then cash. Cash has uh, moved up a rank uh, since a week ago, uh, and, and it, it beat out consumer non-cyclicals non here. Um, and like I said, real estate is, is moving down. So your, your changes here, the Dow 30 has jumped up, uh, small cap. Has uh, has come up and, and is flirting with uh, uh, you know a nice uh, positive momentum change. Real estate though uh, has dropped uh, two two positions and uh, and then your mid caps have uh, have moved up. Um, uh, actually, the mid caps have stayed the same from last week, but uh, that that uh, that is kind of the lay of the land right now. Uh, in terms of, of the indexes. Okay, and just to put a wrap on this, let's take a look, a quick look at our structured note values. Uh, those are all uh, improved uh, from last week. And so, uh, as a matter of fact, uh, the coupon day just passed by uh, this week. So everybody got vested in another coupon payment that'll probably hit your accounts next week. So that's the fun part of all of that, right? Okay. Until next time, it's, it's a really nice week, a really vast improvement over the, over the previous week before. And, uh, and we'll continue to uh, get ready and, and, and monitor things and get ready for uh, the end of the uh, Q2 and get ready for Q3 uh, as we move through this month and, uh, and, and start getting into, uh, into June and, and start wrapping up the quarter and be ready for some posture changes as we get into Q3. All right, have a great weekend. Stay safe. And most importantly, stay happy. Studies show it's the key to longevity.